Hi friends, welcome and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hi, my name is Sigrid and I make videos about books because I love them. Today, I'm going to be showing you guys some of the books that I picked up from Target's recent buy one get one half off sale. It's kind of funny because I went into that sale thinking that I had already bought enough books, which is never the correct answer. It's always, I don't have enough books, but I was not, I couldn't think of a book that I actually wanted to get. and. I obviously ended up finding quite a few to buy. So I'm just going to go over the books that I got. So first up, I saw that Christina C. Jones books are at Target. And they're really inexpensive. They're like $10 at the most. And I got a few. So the first one I got is this one that was on my uh, wish list. So this one is Pulling Doubles. And I just, I fell in love with this cover. It's so beautiful. Um, and then I have this one, which is part of a series. This is book one in the Love Sisters series. Um, and this is I Think I Might Love You. And then we have Bending the Rules. And this is another series that is the same as this one. So it's two different series, but this is book three in that series. Then we have I Think I Might Want You, which is book three in the other series, the Love Sisters series. And then finally we have I Think I Might Need You, which is book two um, in the Love Sisters series. And if you can tell by the cover, that's like a pregnancy test. So it's obviously, it's obviously going to have an unplanned pregnancy trope, which is interesting. Um, the next thing I got in the romance section was Lucy Score's book, Things We Never Got Over. I also got the sequel, which is coming out later this month. Um, I think it's Things We Had From the Light or something like that. It's a pink cover, but I also got that in the sale. Then I got Icebreaker by Hannah Grace. I, I really wanted to give it a try just to see if I also liked it. I got the latest book in the Never After series by Emily McIntyre, and this is Twisted. You guys couldn't see it, but I have the red of the series as well so these are just going to now I have them all <laughs> then I got a Britney cherry book this is the mixtape and this was only like seven dollars so I was like I'd be crazy to leave it and I actually always wanted to read something from her then we got a book that I have wanted to read for quite some time this is sweet dandelion by Michaela Smeltzer I I really wish that I could have gotten the hardcover, but it wasn't available at Target and I really wanted to get it during the sale. So I ended up getting the paperback, but it's really pretty and I love this cover. Then we have Archer's Voice by Mia Sheridan. I think I've heard some good things about this one as well. So I'm excited to see. Uh, next we have Every Summer After by Carly Fortune. Um, I saw this one on the Goodreads Choice Awards and I really wanted to just check it out and I've heard some good stuff about it. Now we're gonna get into my thrillers. Um, First up, we have Confessions by Kane Minato. I think I saw this one on Kayla from Books and Lala's channel, so I really wanted to check this one out. And then I saw this one. I haven't heard much about this one, but it just, the title intrigued me. But this one says, everyone in my family has killed someone, and it's by Benjamin Stevenson. It just sounds really good. Um, the thing about it is like it came with like a little rip in the dust jacket, and I don't know if I need to be that person, but... Do I need to return it or get a replacement? I don't know. Like, I just, because I paid, like, I don't know. I don't want to be that person, but I also want my books to look a certain way, too. Uh, next up, we have House of Hunger by Alexis Henderson. So excited to read this one. I think this is more towards the horror genre than thrillers, but I am so excited. And I think it's a vampire novel, so... Then we got The Candy House by Jennifer Egan. I actually saw this in one of my favorite booktubers. I think it was Life is Monet. I think she picked it as one of her like TBRs and she was so excited to read it. So I looked it up and it sounded really good. So I was like, okay, I'm going to add that to my list. <laughs> and finally, we have Just the Nicest Couple by Mary Kubica. Kubica. Kubica, I think. Um, I actually heard about this on a TikTok. Someone was just saying, they were describing the book and they was like, it's this book. And so um, I am easily influenced. <laughs> yeah, that's everything that I got from Target's latest sale. And I love to share it with you guys. Yeah, so that's everything that I have for you guys today. Until next time, I will see you in the next video. Bye.